I'm not gonna cut that out. You guys, we're working on a coupe today. We'll stop. A little bit of different uh, scene today. No cars, um, house has to be worked on uh, as well. So you might have seen um, in our uh, previous episode, we did the siding on this thing. Now I'm doing a paint. So I got a brush, got some rollers, got some paint. We're doing a perfectly gray on the outside and we're gonna do the trims uh, are gonna be white, just like the garage, house garage. So I'm gonna go paint a little bit and uh, Jeremiah's cleaning it. Oh, yeah. Scrubbing it, scrubbing that thing. Yeah, so just a house, house chore day, doing some things, you know, enjoying the weather. It's by the way, it's basically mid November and it's still like 75 today, like really, really nice, breezy, super nice weather. You guys enjoy it. Thank God for the weather. Painted this side of the chicken coop. This is my setup right here. Okay, thank you. And then I got this painted right here. All the walls, this trim is gonna be white, right right there around the doors and windows. So this side is done. Then we're moved out. This is top is done. We're moving to this side, as you can see. See that right there. Now we're gonna do this side and uh, just continue with the trim. The paint dries really fast, so I don't really have a lot of time to film and paint at the same time. So I'm just gonna knock it down and um, start on a uh, trim. side is done completely all done just finished that um, basically the trim is gonna be after I decided to do the trim all the way uh, around but uh, in white but after uh, I'm done with the whole walls with all four walls so to the this one is done and the one with the door where the doors are it's not much for this uh, third wall and I also have a little bit left in the gallon, so I might have to go and uh, get another gallon because this is not enough. And this is the Sherwin Williams Weather Shield one. Really thick, really good paint. Uh, we used it on a garage, it's called Perfectly Grayish. And um, this is the trim right here. Just super white, extra white, whatever. Um, you just roll it with the smaller roller. So that's enough for the uh, trims, but this is not enough for me so I'm gonna go and uh, continue on this wall right here I already moved my uh, fencing I'm gonna continue on this wall right here and uh, see how much I need I just did the side completely all the way from the top the bottom and then this one is done and the other one is done by the doors and I just ran out of paint that's my um, my tray right there empty the gallon is empty so uh, what I'm gonna do right now is run to Lowe's and get some uh, paint and I do have the trim and I'm gonna finish it up real quick just uh, yeah that's the progress the whole coop is done let's see let's see in the this side right here you see it here this is done once I get paint the trim white, it's gonna look really nice. So I have to run to Lowe's real quick before it gets dark. It gets dark really fast, but the weather today is beautiful. It was like 75, 73, beautiful sunny day. Everything is um, just dry, a little windy, but um, beautiful, beautiful November day here in Carolina, really warm and uh, can't ask for more. This is perfect. Done with three walls. Like I said before, this one is the fourth one in the back. Um, basically, I started, I went to the store, I got another gallon of paint. I'm not gonna need a gallon, but I got a gallon just to have extra for the shop. 
and um, for this just there's touch up needed so um, and the reason maybe you're wondering why the reason I am uh, rolling it on and not spraying it on because my spray gun I had the um, spray gun uh, that was um, functional but something happened to it I couldn't get it going so I'm just rolling it on on this siding and I have to use this brush to trim uh, to put underneath because when you spray it you sp it gets in everywhere but when you roll it it just misses spots so I have to like kind of fix it a little bit and I mean it takes only like a second to go through right there like that and um, there's paint left over on the edge so and this is really thick paint this is the uh, the outdoor paint that I showed you guys before so we just go like this and brush it underneath there it's all good it covers it really, really fast like this because there's a bunch of paint underneath so it ain't gonna rot or nothing and I gave an inch overlap on each siding piece so <clears throat> this is pretty good deal right here so I have something left what half a wall a little bit more than half left to do and then after that we'll be doing the white trim on the edges or corners and the windows and doors all right chicken coop is done um, the top piece will be brown or black I just don't have the paint I'm just gonna take um, a brush and just brush it on I forgot to get a quart but the trim is done white this is uh, perfectly grayish trim is white doors are done corners right here if you see this corner right there then you got the window look at that beautiful trim I did smear a little bit here I'm gonna go do a touch up right now just a little bit of paint I got my helper hey baby hey so this is not Thomas this is a female <laughs> he screwed up and I got a female and I we just realized that so now we're gonna have to call her Timmy uh, Tina or something something comment with the name for my cat good guys look at this walking around like she owns the place yeah so this side is done trim is good um, all this mirror I'm gonna just take it off right now um, yeah sunny day still beautiful this side is done let me go to this one this one is good look at that day and night man this thing was ugly look at this beautiful this wall is already dry this is the back wall it's already dry oh, there you go found a way out that's it perfect guys thank you for watching god bless you guys thank you for being supportive enjoy the day enjoy your week and go to church uh go praise god be thankful for just regular everyday things um trump 2024 you guys congratulations to trump hopefully we get better um the economy is gonna turn out to be better you know gas prices and stuff like that but you guys voted and you got the results so um pray for the government hopefully we're gonna have you know a good four years god bless you guys your families stay strong um thank you for watching enjoy your weekend peace out